Update 24, everyone is so excited for it, but it still is not out yet. But to be ready for it, I have collected every single code, which is going to give you guys a bunch of free 2 times XP. So let's get started. Uh, so before we get into it, I was uh, just exploring in C2. And then I saw, you know, of course, this like plant island. And I was like, you know, this looks pretty cool. And then I saw the big plant in the middle. I was like, okay, let's just go ahead and climb that. And then I saw that there is a mysterious NPC at the top. I didn't expect anything to be up here. I just wanted to get like a nice screenshot if not talk to me yet so it's gonna be the first time it's a mysterious man with a big belly um so uh, what's going on dude so he says hey okay go away uh, really that's it but yeah today guys we are back because we are ready for the next update and are excited for when it's gonna be arriving so of course we know a lot of stuff already we know of course dragon fruit's gonna be reworked and we, of course, know that there's going to be some new areas, new training areas, and a bunch more. So I want to go ahead and update you guys, of course, with everything that I've found so far. Of course, if there's some other stuff that people need to know, comment down below if I miss something. But I tried to figure out every single people's, like, leaks online to make sure that, of course, this is all confirmed updates as well. So all these are going to be from the admins or the devs from Bloxfruit. So, of course, these are all going to be confirmed. They're all, like, retweeted things as well. So we make sure that everything that I'm showing you guys is is 100% legit and not like some some random post that people are like trying to be like oh this is it you know something 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 uh but yeah so we're gonna start off with Shafi right here some auras and enchantment stuff for the blocks fruits update we can see some of the swords over here in the middle and some of them are actually blurred so they're actually not allowed to be spoiled yet but we can see some stuff from below so we can see some ice lightning on the sword over here we can see some green lightning on the sword over on the right and some more black evil lightning on this one as well we can see the enchantment on the left actually later comes back in one of the guns so this seems to be a aura and enchantment that's going to be applicable to everything so it doesn't really only limit itself to swords but it's going to be absolutely exciting so that's the first one then up next guys we got ourselves a big block with post of course this one is quite old guys from july 14th so this is, of course, like the update of the announcement of the dragon fruit. So their people are no longer hiding. It's time for those who were hardened by fire to rise from the ashes. Once a pacifist, pacifist race nearly wiped out during the dragon's first Hydra's battle. Now they rise up with their hearts set ablaze for vengeance. On the mounts of what they was once the dragon island, the Draco have quietly built a dojo training in secret to reclaim their homeland. So we will see more of this area as well in a little bit in some more screenshots. So we have a new area. Area, and of course we have the rework as well which is awesome then up next we got ourselves more chains are coming the dragon fruits not their only focus guns have been reworked from the ground up with enhanced mechanics and visuals hydra island has been fully reimagined the famous Uzoth has built a dojo in the cliffs packed with new challenges hidden treasures will you master the dragon talon dojo so this is absolutely awesome we can see as well of course on the video some of the weapons we see some bows and stuff we later on have another clip of some more weaponry uh, that they have reworked, more gun type, which is absolutely awesome. But, you know, I really like when they rework stuff and do some different things, so this just is amazing. And I'm excited to see the Dragon Talon Dojo myself. Uh, I will have to train a little bit more because I'm pretty sure this is going to be in a lot higher area than I'm currently at. Uh, but it's fine. It gives me a reason to do some more grinding in this game. So next up, we have a 4K shot of the Eclipse captured in Bloxfruit. And you can see as well, this is in the very first C with the Dragon Fruit. You can see the Dragon a little bit at the top of it in the screenshot right there. And we can see as well that the Eclipse is firing down meteors you can see there's a bunch of fire and stuff happening on the island so there is some stuff going on this could of course be a separate ability that's raining down but we can see like at least one or two abilities being used in this screenshot right here we can see the big eclipse in the sun in the sky and then we can see the meteors falling down in here as well which is absolutely awesome so so much stuff to cover guys it's crazy okay up next we got some more dragon stuff and we got another example of one of the abilities we sadly of course cannot see which ability this is but you know it still looks pretty cool then we have another one this is going to be some more so we now of course see the dragon mastery 38 so it's not even oh actually these are all mastery zero so probably this is either some sort of testing these are all level zero or we don't know the numbers yet uh but you can see it's the fear meter 
Heat Wave Cannon, Infernal Pincer, Scorching Downfall, Imperial Evolution, and Draconic Soar. Probably Draconic Soar is gonna be the big thing in the sky, I would assume. Uh, Imperial Evolution, Scorching Downfall could be the thing you can see on this screenshot right here. And yeah, the rest we don't really know. Imperial Evolution, of course, we know that's this one. Uh, not too bad. So we have the King's Roar. Ooh, it could be this could be the new title of the ability, but it still looks amazing. And you can see like the character I think is over here. It looks a bit weird. Um, and then we can see everything just like splashing out. It looks really cool. Then we have of course the Sky Darkest. I think this is like maybe the pre-eclipse or the new eclipse image it could be that this of course turns into this or this is the starting animation but you can see we have two versions of this eclipse icon and i don't know if this is like the pre one i personally really like the star but it could be that like the star turns into the eyes or the eyes turn into the star uh but still i think this is absolutely beautiful i can't wait to see this um, and then we have ourselves a nice little beginning punch. Thing's probably the first ability doing a little bit of damage. We can see a new quest giver, I think, as well in the background. Of course, correct me if I'm wrong. I've not seen the latest areas yet. This could be a, an existing place, uh, but this looks like a new-ish area. And then we have ourselves some more stuff. This is going to be the sword enchantment. So this enchantment we saw in the very first image on the left. So you can see this one, and this one is the exact same. So you can see it's an enchantment you actually put on the weapon, you turn it on, which is absolutely awesome. You can see it affects the arms and it affects the weapons, and there is just so much stuff. So you can see it affects the gun as well, when we see a little bit of a gun. Sadly, he doesn't fire the gun. I really wonder if there's going to be like custom particles from firing a weapon or whatever based on your aura, but at least the surrounding the like of the weapon is based on the aura you have equipped which is absolutely awesome like these things look so cool i can't wait to have these myself like like blocks fruits is a pretty old game and especially like c1 c2 everything looks kind of dated i really wish they would fully rework the whole uh the whole beginning areas to be honest uh but like with these particles the game looks a lot more modern and so so good uh, of course, let me know what you guys think about that. Maybe you'd like the, 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 that kind of stuff, but I think it's nice if they update some stuff. Then we have a quick showcase of the new Instinct animation. Absolutely amazing. Very anime-like. Absolutely super cool. Uh, as well, can't wait to see this inside of the real game. I'm not really a PvP or that kind of sense, but um, I don't think this will be useful at all in PvM scenarios. Probably just like a pure PvP ability, um, but it still looks very, very cool. And yeah, I like the I like the fancy that this uh, ability has. Then we have ourselves. All text in the game will now receive stun animation. The next update is one of the many changes coming your way. We continue to appreciate your patience. Because, of course, this is taking a long time, guys. This update is taking a long, long, long time. But we now got some stun animations, which is absolutely awesome. You can see, of course, this is a 1625 level Islander. And a little bit of a weird image is like a bomb image together with two NPCs. It's like a rework of the bomb ability because I think that's the ability in the game. Yeah, so we have the bomb ability. Um, I don't know if this Devil Fruit will get some new stuff. Maybe a rework, maybe some buffs. I don't know. A bit of a weird image to give us, to be honest. And then the final one that we have that I could find. Of course, if there's some other stuff I missed, comment it down below. Uh, we have ourselves some more leaks of the dojo. So I'm going to just be, of course, these are not all that is going to be the surrounding areas as well. But we can see a little bit of the environments looking absolutely awesome. It's only four images, sadly. I really like this waterfall area. Looks really, really cool. But yeah, there we go. That is all the leaks I could find personally on the brand new update of Block Streets. So yeah, I'm super excited for all this stuff to be finally in the game. You guys have been waiting for so, so, so long. Of course, let me know what is the thing you're excited for the most inside of all these new updates for Block Streets. I think my number one is going to be the new enchantments and stuff. Like, they just look so cool. And I would love to try out the guns inside the game as well because I have never used a gun in this game. Besides, of course, like, a bazooka doesn't really count. Like, I'm just using this to aggro some mobs you know but i've never really used them to to battle you know like i would love to do that i've used some sorts i've used the dark blade a little bit you know but i've mainly just 
I've uh, been using some other stuff and never used the gun. So I would love to see the rework of the guns and see how good it actually is. So the final thing I want to do is give you guys all the updated codes and as well give away some devil fruits because those are of course are going to be very useful for your training yourself or for the future with the dragon fruit. So let's start off with the dragon fruit giveaway first. I think what I want to do is I want to give away two fruits. I want to give away a dragon fruit. That's one thing. And of course, what I've been using to train with, I want to give away a Buddha fruit as well. Because these things are going to be awesome because the dragon fruit is going to be for late game. And the Buddha fruit is going to carry you all the way to the end game. So if you're just like me and you're still leveling, then the Buddha fruit is going to be so useful. This thing is amazing, guys. Combine it with some nice, you know, flying kicks. And it's just so good, guys. It is so, so good. Super easy training and definitely something you could use. So if you guys want any of the two fruits, what you have to do, you're going to have to like this video, subscribe if you're new, comment down below the fruit you want. So comment down below Dragon, comment down below Buddha, which one you want to get. Together with your Robux username, it's everything you have to do, and then I can be able to get myself a winner from the giveaway from that. So besides that, we of course have all the codes currently inside the game. So let's go ahead and give you guys some codes so you can get yourself some double XP to use to train up. So first up, we have the code to grade A's. Then we have source the code to Tantai Gaming. Then we have source code sub to Uncle Kizaru. After that, we have source code sub to Noob Master123. Then we have also a reset token for sub to game robot underscore reset one. Then we have source code sub to game robot underscore XP one. Then we have source code sub to fur nine nine nine. Then we have source code sub to dig rock after that. Then we have source code sub to captain Maui. Then we have source code straw hat main. Then we have source code star code Ahio. We have this code Magic Bus. After that, we have this code Kit Gaming. Then we have the code JCWK. After that, we have this code FUD10 V2. After that one, we have this code FUD10. We have this code NU underscore is underscore pro for some more XP. And then we're going to go into some a joke code. We have this code Chandler for zero belly. It works, but doesn't give you anything. We have this code Bloxy for some more XP. Then we have this code Big News for an in-game title. And we have this code Axior. Then we have this code Sub to Official Newbie. And then we have this code Kid Reset. These are the older codes. And then the newest code there is, guys, is going to be the code Earn underscore Fruits for... 10, uh, I think it's like 20 minutes off 2 times XP. So yeah, absolutely awesome. So that is going to be all the codes working currently inside of the world of Blocks, which is absolutely amazing. And yeah, I'm super excited for the next update coming out. Of course, comment down below which fruit you want to earn into the giveaway as well. And I will say thanks so much for watching. If you did enjoy, hit that like button down below. Guys, subscribe if you're new. to see you guys later today or tomorrow for another video. See you guys. Take care. Love, bye. Thanks so much for watching. And of course, as well, take care, guys.